Hi guys, welcome to another video. Today's video, I am swatching the new Super Stay Vinyl Ink Nudes Liquid Lip Color from Maybelline. I picked these up from Ulta. They were $12.99. They come in 10 shades. I picked up five of the 10 shades to give it a try. I was about to give it away. <laughs> I won't say anything. Shake up your long wear with budge resistant super stay vinyl ink new lip colors. This color lock formula defines smudging and transfer for up to 16 hours of wear. Shake and swipe for instant shine. So if you want to see how these swatch on my skin tone, stay tuned. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye guys. Okay guys, let's jump right into it. The first shade is 120 Punchy. Shake it up, cause they say you're supposed to shake it up. No lip liner or anything. You know, this is a real, just a swatch for you all to see. I hope I'm close enough. Don't mind the eyeshadow. I would have put on a new eyeshadow, but this is what I wore to work. So this is Punchy. And of course, no lip liner or anything, but for this shade, I would definitely need a lip liner. This is a really pretty nude. It smells like punch too, for whatever reason. But this is the shade Punchy. 120 Punchy. Next up is 110 All Struck. All Struck. This is kind of like a pinky shade. Yeah, the first one was more nude. Yeah, I know I've been loving my pinks lately, so this is right up my alley, especially a soft pink. So this is 110 all struck, all struck. <laughs> These feel amazing on the lips. I'm not my lips together, smacking my lips together because I don't want the color to stick because I have so many to swatch. But this is all struck. Nice, pretty shade. Even without a liner, I will wear this. Next up is 130 extra. Kind of like a burnt orange shade. These don't have color descriptions for them. This one is pretty. Yeah, I know I'd be trying to stay away from as much color as I can, but 130 Extra is pretty on my skin tone. It's kind of like a really burnt, deep orange shade. 130 Extra. Next up is 135 Fearless, which is a warm brown shade. Yeah, I know I was going to pick this one up. I would have never left this. Mm -hmm. Even if I don't use it as an all over shade, I'll always use this as a lip liner.
I'm gonna let it sit for about a minute and then apply another layer. Cause right now you see it's, I won't say it's patchy, but I feel like I need another layer to make it even out. I don't want to take this shade off. <laughs> don't mind if it's not like perfect guys because this is a lip swatch video. I'm not going out the house like this. So this is 135 Fearless, a very warm brown. I got lipstick everywhere, but y'all get the idea. This is just to show you the color. I love this. I love this, especially with the eye look. I think we're on our last one because my lips starting to stain. We have 130 Charged, which, is, which was the deepest shade they had. It's still a brown shade, according to the bottle. So let's see. If I didn't show y'all the why, this is how it looks. I feel like the deeper shades, you probably need two or three light coats. I'm going to let this sit for a half a second also, and I'm going to apply one more layer just to even everything out. I'll be right back. This is pretty. I'm not even a dark, dark girl like that, but this is pretty. This is 140 charged. It's kind of, I don't know how it's coming off on camera, but in real life, it's like the deepest brown you ever saw. The deepest brown. Don't mind this. <laughs> but this is charged, right? Yeah, 140 charged. Okay, just to create me a combo, I'm going to use 135 Fearless to outline. I still got charged, stain my lips, but that's fine. And I only had it on for like half a second. So that goes to show you like even once it wears off, you'll still have a tint of color on your lips. Let's take one twenty punchy in the center. I don't know, y'all. I'm just trying to do something. Okay guys, I'm back. This is the completed lip combo I was able to achieve. I already love it. I love the wear, the feel of these lifter lipsticks. Oh man, they feel amazing. Some people say they're sticky on their lips, but I find that it's not sticky on mine. And I love them. <laughs> and I'm so happy they came out with a new collection because you all know that this is right up my alley. So let me know. If you plan on picking these up, if you have not already, and like, comment, and subscribe, and I'm going to see you later. Bye, guys.